Howdy folks, Max Caveman here, bringing you another TCG opening. Today I'll be opening the Pokemon Fusion Strike expansion for the Sword and Shield era. Um, it's not really much to say in this situation. Um, it's literally, literally just a case. Um, I have just taken everything out of the box. So let's get into opening this. Um, let's just clear some space. Um, while I get set up, let me tell you about uh, JJ's Cards. So this video is brought to you by JJ's Cards. JJ Cards is a Perth-based TCG store that offers a variety of TCG products such as uh, sealed boxes for Pokemon, Digimon, and Dragon Ball, with the potential to expand into others depending on interest. There, he also does sleeves and deck boxes, so a typical um, TCG store. However, JJ's Cards also offers play sets for Digimon and Cardfight Vanguard that allows you to obtain one of every, a playset of every card within a breakdown from the set, uh, such as getting four of each color in Digimon and four of each card for the nation. Uh, JJ's cards will have a ever-growing list of stock so it's best to check out the links below to see if there's anything that you are interested in. Okay, so that after that, let's get into this. So I'm going to be doing a half a box per video. Um, so I'm going to start off with this left side. Um, I know these packs can be weighed. I would rather just have all the commons and all the non holo rares so I'm not really interested in that but from this set the main two Pokemon I'm after are the new Boltun V and then the Gengar V and V Max so let's get started oh and this just remind me, for anyone that is not aware, the code cards for the each pack have now changed to the Pokemon Trading Card Live instead of online. The white borders do not have a hollow and above. It there are a black border. Let me just see. These are some I opened from my uh, pre-release pack, so you can see the difference. Let's get started. So we've got a Grass Energy, Simicea, Cross Receiver, Sligu, Totodile, Phantump, Snorlax, Snom, Dreepy, a Reverse Snorlax into a Maractus. Uh, this set also introduced a new battle style, the namesake for the set, the Fusion Strike battle style, so, like this Droopy here. Um, so there are going to be a few cards in here that synergize well, specifically with other Fusion Strikes. So we've got a Dark Energy. Barascuda, Cotharaja, Cook, Totodile, Baneri, Clobopus, Tynamo, Zorua, Reverse Trevenant, into a Hollow Toxtricity. Let's that side. That's got a massive Hollow Bleed across the entire card. That actually looks really good.
It's got a lightning energy, cook, Mulgram, quick ball, clauncher, growlithe, stuffle, sigilith, toxel, reverse persian, and a electrode. So a fighting energy, bug catcher, wigglytuff, phalanx, onyx, Tootle, shroomish, klefki, trubbish, reverse steelix, and an oricorio. Another one of the fusion strike Pokemon. So we've got a Fire Energy, Graveler, Mushana, Heatmore, Quillfish, Vulpix, Chansey, Galarian Zigzagoon, Mankey, Reverse Makuhita, and a Holographic Starmie. So for some reason these packs feel flimsy. Um, I guess would be the right way to describe it. Um, they tear quite easily. Um, but we've got a Psychic Energy, Shana, Primeape, Simipore, Phalanx, Toodle, Vullaby, Dupider, Meowth, Reverse Mantine, A, my first V, a Rillaboom V. So a Metal Energy, Simisage, Sydney, Battle VIP Pass, Durant, Pansier, Minum, Baltoy, Galarian Corsola, Aracuda Reverse, and a Kangaskhan. So we've got a Water Energy, Beware. Dracolic, Corvus Squire, Pansage, Kufant, Glycar, Slugma, Skitty, Reverse Darkrai. That actually looks really good. And an Electros. So I have a Dark Energy, Lopunny, Marsh Stomp, Cross Receiver, Kufant, oh, that one's meant to go there, a Impidimp, Snom, Onyx, Jigglypuff, Reverse Toxicroak. I'm just double checking that move. A hey, Full Art, Schoolgirl. Oops. So this has a school boy um, companion. It, I think it would be really good if I get the school girl and school boy. Sorry, just trying to focus on the carton here. No, it's trying to focus on that. Um, so getting the school boy would be a nice um, card to get now. Get the two of them. So a grass energy, a puku muku. Eldegoss, Power Tablets, Caterpie, Morpeko, Eevee, Shelter, Voltorb, 
Reverse Dancer, and an Acelgor. So we've got a Lightning Energy. A Laser Spark. Ooh. That's going to catch me off. Um, beware. Skaters Park. Helioptile. Wooloo. Gustafleur. Mudkip. Sandshrew. Reverse Cross Receiver. And a Genesect V. Okay. I will say, looking at the Fusion Strike, the biggest downside to it is having to have a whole bunch of Fusion Strike cards in your deck um, to activate effects. Um, some of them are well, relatively easy to pull off. Some just require a little bit more setup. But we have a Fighting Energy Breloom Cross Switcher. So this is, um, for example, this card. It's a Fusion Strike card. You must play two Cross Switchers at once for this card to work. Um, so you have to have two to use. So it's a little bit more cost um, costly, but I would love to see it actually get pulled off. We have a Garbodor, Shinx, Shelmet, Drilba, Bunnelby, Mudkip, Reverse Zero Aura, and a Hollow Swampert. I have a Fire Energy, Delcaddy, Darkrai, Croconaw, Shelmet, Plusle, Moona, Meowth, Meryl, Reverse Sand Slash, and a Cloyster. So I have a Psychic Energy, Farewell Bell, Lofani, Hariyatma, Tynamo, Galarian Meowth, Gossifleur, Panpaw, Eevee, Reverse Grubbin, and a Meloetta. So we've got a Metal Energy, Schoolboy, Primeape, Zarude, Smeagol, Carvana, oops, Clampearl, Morpeko, Skarmory, Reverse Gossifleur, and a Latios. As, um, I have used it um, at the pre-release event that I went to. But there is an amazing combo between Latios and Latias that just allows you to stack Psychic Energy uh, like with ease. Um, so in theory you could attach four, five, even I think you can attach six energies in one turn if you have your field set up right. Right, so we've got a Water Energy, Gliscor, Mandibuzz, Ninetales, Growlithe, Phalanx, Morpeko, Smeagol, Quillfish, Reverse for Alligator, and a Galarian Obstagoon Hollow.
It's going to need Dark Energy, Metapod, Battle VIP Pass, Toga Tomorrow, Skarmory, Jinx, Mantine, Grubbin, Rotom, Reverse Galarian Darumaka, sorry, Galarian Darmanitan, I don't know why I said Darumaka, and Maractus. So, this is going to be the last pack for this video. So, let's see if I can get anything good. Yeah. It's just a white code card, so... Got a Grass Energy, a Lapras, Schoolboy, Chili, Silen, and Cress, Pansage, Wooloo, Pancham, there's the Glare and Darumaka, <laughs> Indeedy, Reverse Mawile, and an Azumarill. Now, there's an interesting thing about this card. Hold on, I got one not that long ago. Wasn't... It was a couple of packs ago. Where did it go now? There it is. So, these two cards, if you cannot tell, actually share the same background. Um, there is a, basically, a story that is being played out over, I believe it was four cards. It may have been five. Um, but in the previous set, Evolving Skies, there was... A Smeargle and Eldegoss that came through here first. Um, okay, so it looks like it's Smeargle, then Meowth, Eldegoss, then Morwile. Um, because in the Morwile's artwork, um, Not sure if you can see it, but there are seeds on it, and there are multiple sets of footprints. I really like this addition to the artworks. Um, being able to basically see a story between all the different Pokemon is quite interesting. Um, but that's it for this uh, episode hopefully enjoyed uh, make sure to check out the links below to JJ's cards and enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you next time see ya